Guys, so right now I'm so excited. So I just picked up the car um, this morning. They gave me a call saying that my car was ready. I thought it was gonna be Monday, but apparently uh, technician stayed overnight and they, you know, fixing my car. Well, I already got it fixed. So uh, it just had to be uh, reprogrammed and that's all. And you know what the crazy thing about the goddamn Mercedes dealership, it was like, you should work for us and all that. He said, if you manage to drop the valve body and do all that for yourself, you should come work with us. I thought he was joking around, but that man was dead behind serious. He was telling me about this program they was having where they can like train the tech, but I already told him I'm already like in a good uh, possession, uh, pu profession and I love it. So I, I don't see myself doing that. I just see myself doing this car stuff like on the side. Mind you, I always wanted to build a car. But it just like never, I just never like uh, associated myself to that, like that point. Like I had drawings and all that I used to draw cars and stuff. So that's my replica, but that might be someday down the road. But right now I just want to pick this up off the ground and just look back like, damn, we got glad I started it. So anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Uh, me and my brother, we just cutting up a little bit, chilling, cruising. And we had a, people trying to race us and stuff, but we wasn't really... We push on it a little bit, but not too crazy. And man, my car feel amazing and great. Uh, however, I do not have cruise control. The reason why, because it's probably that little switch. I probably gotta replace that again. Uh, that happened to me last time and cruise control started working. So I get that sorted out the way, but right now all I'm happy is the car is driving. So sorry for all the long talking. Let's get to the video. Alright guys, look, so I can go to one, four and all that. Oh my goodness, and I can go to drive. So the only thing they had to do is just uh, reprogram the car. So, so guys, on this part, I basically repeated myself on what the guy had said. He was trying to recruit me uh, to, you know, join in the day team and all, but I'm good, man. I'm really good, but I appreciate the offer and all that. Uh, but if y'all looking to, you know, work anywhere, man, y'all go up there, they helping out, they need uh, people and all that. But anyway, I'm excited. Uh, thanks to Mercedes of Augusta. Y'all got great customer service. I appreciate y'all and just thank y'all, man. I'm like happy right now. Guys, uh, I got so much joy right now. Uh, she driving pretty smooth, real smooth. Uh, I'm taking it slow, hitting it here and there, but nothing too crazy. I uh, also got my uh, brother behind me too. His, this car looking so sweet and nice. This thing looking so sweet. I, I, I love this car, man. Uh, he always gave me a chance to drive it and all that. So, I mean, I just drive it. Just have fun with it. Uh, I'm gonna go over And guys, y'all can, I can hear it now when it uh, shift. Yeah, I can hear it now. Um, but this car is driving real wonderful. Can't wait till I put all of this whole interior together. So yeah, uh, I'm at, uh, you know, downtown. And man, I, 
I love the scenery down here, uh, especially like the river walking and all that. So ain't nothing too crazy. Guys, I'm in uh, manual mode. She she ripping. She ripping in manual mode. So guys, I'm gonna do a price breakdown. I'm in South Carolina right now, just uh, crossed over the bridge. So anyway, uh, all they had to do was just reprogram my uh, car and the adaption for the transmission uh, control unit. And they check all other things like my windshield wipers, brakes, all that little good stuff. Uh, and the total cost of it was like uh, $228. Uh, like I said, thanks to them, I thought it wasn't going to be fixed, but it did got fixed, so uh, I'm happy and all that. So now I can proceed to do things to this car and all that. As y'all can see, look at my roof liner. I, I've been meaning to do my roof liner for the longest, but that might be down the road. That's something I don't even care about. Um, I'm going to do like some uh, other little, uh, good little uh, goodies and all that. Nothing too crazy. Um... But yeah, they check coolant, belts, they check everything. Everything is running flawless. Uh, I had it in uh, manual mode. Uh, it's running good. It feels it feels a little more uh, quicker and all that too, uh, by the way. Uh, you know, just the, just the hair or whatever. Uh, not too crazy. But I'm gonna show y'all uh, the thing or whatever. I'm gonna show let me go. All right. Show let me go. Oh, all right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yes, ma'am. Not any three lanes. We cutting up. We are cutting up. Guys, this is a fun highway. Uh, I think this highway you go like about 70, 65 or whatever. But it's people trying to race us and we just cooling and stuff. And y'all see this light hat came back on, but I think um, I think I need to turn my steering wheel left and uh, then right. But Every, the car been running flawless and stuff. I ain't had no issues. Tips running fine. But we have this black Jaguar right here and then a Mercedes behind us that was trying to race us. But we was just cooling and stuff. Then my brother just driving like how we drive normally. And this thing trying to push up on us. <laughs> this thing funny as hell, boy. Hey, man, it's a good day, beautiful day. I'm so excited. Can't wait till I get back home uh, to put this thing back to rest. So we try to catch up to him, but... I also got my police to uh, tech the thing work wonders. So if y'all ever need one, go to O'Reilly's, get one for about like 47. This thing works wonders. A police could be all the way down the road and this thing will pick up something and I see them. I won't be surprised. So yeah. Oh, that old guy right there trying to speed on it. Oh, the people so fun. People so fun. Should I pull up on the Mercedes or should I not?
nicely, guys. Guys, I like going through towns like this uh, with these like older homes and all that. Like I love these uh, older style homes. Kind of remind me of like my uh, my boss's house, something like that. I love uh, older homes and stuff like this. So guys, that would be it uh, for this video. Uh, Y'all probably seen them uh, two orange lights. Uh, that's the ABS ESP light. Uh, it might be something real small, but it, it comes and go. I probably need to turn my steering wheel all the way to the left and all the way to the right. But no need to explain all that. Uh, then, like I said, cruise control. This is my second time saying this. Just probably need to replace that uh, safety switch, I think, or something uh, behind the gas pedal, and that should be it. But I ain't worried about that. Car drives smooth. Uh, it's driving. Um, and like I said, everything was good. So my work paid off. I don't think I could. I don't think I should have dropped the, uh, the the valve body the second time because you know once I tried to clear the codes, I kept getting the same error. But apparently the codes I'm getting is totally different on uh, what the Mercedes uh, uh, end up getting. So uh, I was able to clear, I was able to program and stuff. So really the first time I dropped the valve body, put everything in, put it back in, I probably should have just left it as that and took it because the car would have been done. But you live and you learn. Um, we have fixed our issues, so we don't have no problem. Uh, everything feeling good. Uh, the next project to do on this car though is to replace uh, the valve. Um, I think it's the valve gasket, replace that. Uh, they got one part that's a gasket and one part got glue around it. So, so I would take that whole thing apart, redo it. And probably try to install an oil catch can, probably do research. Cause I don't know how I would be able to install an oil catch can. Uh, I'm not sure, um, but yeah so i see y'all hope y'all enjoy i'm gonna get back on the tahoe finish up that video because the call had came in when i was working on the tile so y'all stay tuned for another video i'm dropping this like in a few it's about to be three four o'clock just i'm gonna drop this go outside work on the tahoe and yeah i get with y'all